Hello YouTube, in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Windows 8.1 um, Pro for absolutely free without having to use a USB stick that needs to be 4 gigabytes or some kind of DVD or disk that you have to burn to to boot on the files. Um, literally every tutorial uh, I, I looked for on the internet you needed a 4 gigabyte USB stick. Now I do have a 4 gigabyte USB stick and I'm, so, I'm sure quite a lot of people do at home but for the people that don't it can be quite an inconvenient so I'm going to be showing you guys how to do it without even having to use anything but your computer. So basically there's going to be a few links in the description that you're going to have to download. Um, these are the ones you're going to need to download. You're going to need the ISO for Windows 8, you're going to need um, Power ISO and you're going to need U-Time. And they're the three ones you're going to need. So first of all <coughs> what you're going to want to do is download U-Time. Now I haven't actually got this right up here, um, right here for you at the moment. Uh, it is here somewhere, but I'm just going to look past this just to save some time. I could look for it in the start menu and stuff, but to be honest, it's pointless. There it is, you tyrant. But anyway, so what you're going to want to do is once you <coughs> have downloaded, uh, actually go to the link, right? and you may know that some Pirate Bay websites are blocked in several countries well this is an unblocked Pirate Bay proxy so you shouldn't have any problem with this and if you on the unlikely event you do have a problem with this uh, just copy the link in the description go to www.hidemyass.com and then paste it in here what this does is hide your IP address so you can even get to the actual real Pirate Bay using this website and then you'll definitely get in it through this but anyway so once you're here, just click get this torrent and it will pop up on the uTorrent thing. Now this is about a 3.34 gigabyte file, so this took me about two hours, but my internet's quite slow, so you, you might even find that it only takes you a few minutes. Depends on your internet speeds. So once it's downloaded and you've extracted it to your desktop, right click on it, <coughs> click power, I'll hover over power ISO, you will have to restart your computer after downloading power ISO for it to uh, do the changes and stuff. But once you've done the restart of the computer and stuff, hover over Power iOS, Pi, Power iOS, oh rather, and click Set Number of Drives. Now you're going to want to set this to either one or two. I just do two just to be safe. So once you click two, uh, right-click over the ISO file, hover over Power ISO, click Mount, and then set the drive that you want to mount it to. Now because I'm um, because I'm already on Windows 8, it's n it's gonna like fuck around a bit, and yeah, I'll just say that, and you know. But for you, this will actually mount. And then when you go onto my computer, um, obviously mine didn't mount then. That's just purely because that isn't actually a Windows 8 file. That's just a random ISO file I'm using for this uh, tutorial just to represent it. But once it's on there, it will. <clears throat> just as you can see I don't even have a DVD in my drive at the moment that's just power so sort of putting one in there but just double click on the CD it will take you to what would look like uh, an official licensed Windows copy and stuff um, then just go through all the steps as you normally would when you're installing something look in the description make sure you get them serial numbers in there and um, yeah so once it's done guys you will actually have the official Windows 8.1 Pro absolutely fine. It'll probably take about 10 minutes to set up, like the actual setup of it. But after that, guys, you're absolutely done. You've got Windows 8. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And how, if you have, then please, please do not hesitate to hit that like button and subscribe, and even share it to your Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, anything you want to share it to. Just share it to your mates. Get this video viral, uh, so people can really sort of, you know, get to grips with the fact that they don't need to have a four gigabyte USB stick and all that stuff. So yeah, I hope this video has helped you guys and if it has then yeah. I'll see you in the next one guys. Bye bye.